Alright guys, how's it going? Welcome back to a brand new video. Now this was absolutely not planned. Um, I came out, um, I haven't seen anything and I wasn't going to record. But I've just come into this field and I've just seen two baby foxes. And one of them hasn't run away. He is in, um, he's in the hedge line right now. And he's got his head poking out. And he is just there watching me. I've laid right down as low as I can. Um, I've got quite a bit of tall grass in front of me so it's kind of blocking me from him and hopefully he'll gain the confidence to come back out. It's absolutely insane. Now what I'm going to do is let me just show you guys the quick photo I got. Now I didn't really get a good photo to be honest um, because he was in the hedge but this just shows, um, just to show you guys that he is in a hedge and he is watching me. You can just make him out in this photo, let me show you. There we go, so you can just make him out there. Oh my god guys, so there's actually two of them. Oh my god, I just managed to get a quick video of them. There's two baby foxes. Um, they've just crossed over the path. One's gone into the next field, I think. And the other one is, 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 is laid down on the bank on the left. They are not phased with me being here at all. I don't think they quite know I'm here. Um, they look so young. That is amazing. One of them says so she just curled up and put to sleep on the side of the bank. Oh my god, that is incredible. Now, I don't think I'm going to be able to get any good shots. Um, especially because fencing in the way of the one that's lying down and gone to sleep. So I'm probably not going to get many, many good shots of that one. But the other one hasn't gone to sleep. He seems quite active, but I do think he's gone into the next field over. Now I don't know whether to risk it and move on to the next field and hope that I see him. Or whether just to wait and hopefully he comes back. Um, and I can catch him in the sun. Both. 
this is absolutely amazing. I wanted to make a video on feather crafting foxes anyway. Um, and I have been trying, but I haven't, I haven't been lucky enough to, to actually see them and to make a video. And then I come out not wanting, I'm well not, you know, specifically trying to make a video. And I see two fox cubs. This is incredible. such a shame that the fence is in the background. Such a shame. Let's see. Yeah, it's a real shame that the fence is there. Um, I think they'd be real good photos otherwise. Oh yeah, what I'll do actually is I'll show you guys. Um, I'll just show you that fox photo I got um, of the second cup. Show you him staring at me uh, behind the fence line. Uh, there we go, so there he is staring right at me. Um, oh, it's absolutely crazy to be experiencing this right now. I'm not sure where the second cop's gone, he might still be on that on the hedge right a bit further up. Um, I don't know if to risk my chances and try and get a bit closer.
did not want to move because if I moved the smallest amount he would have shot off and I wanted to try and get it on video for you guys so I moved as slowly as possible to zoom this camera in hopefully I got it for you guys he's just as you saw he just ran straight ran along the edge again and went back in they are definitely intrigued they definitely don't know they don't know what to make of me I'm very surprised they're not really scared usually if if a fox sees you, they'll just run away. They'll go into a hedge line and you probably won't see them again. But I think because we're so close to their den, or while we're in the same location as their den, they keep going into the hedge and they need to come back out to investigate. I mean, that definitely helps that they're young. So while I'm waiting for them to come back out, I just want to basically use this time to say a big thanks to everyone that's come over and subscribed to my channel. Uh, it's actually insane the amount I've grown recently. I've gone from 68 subscribers to 615 in probably I think about two weeks and it's absolutely insane. Um, I've got so many more video ideas, so many more videos coming. Um, it does take a while for me to film these um, and edit them. Um, because, you know, I do come out a lot, and I do try and film a lot, but not every time I see something, and not every time I get good photos, so it does take a while for me to get a video. Um, this one was just extremely rushed, and I was not expecting anything to happen. I wasn't prepared at all, um, so this video might be a bit here, there, and everywhere, but um, I do hope you, you guys enjoyed it anyway. This was just an incredible experience. Um, I am going to show photos at the end, they're not going to be the best of the foxes because like I say there's fencing and that in the way it would be so much better if there's no fence in there. I have got a few videos as well, um, but I, where I've been out a few hours before this, I did get a few photos as well, so I'll put them at the end of the video as well for you guys. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to sit and wait see if he comes back out. If not, that's going to be the end of the video I think. But this has been such an incredible experience. Um, so yeah, I'm going to sit and wait for a bit longer. Um, I'll obviously let you guys know if something happens, but I think I will end the video here. Um, I do hope you enjoyed it. I'm sorry it's rushed. The next one will be a lot better and a bit more planned. Um, but I do hope you enjoyed it anyway. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And as always, guys, I'll see you in the next video. See you later. Goodbye.